Question 10. The graphs of y equals f of x and y equals g of x are shown. Which graph best represents y equals g of f of x? An equation that could represent the graph of y equals f of x is f of x equals x squared. And an equation that could represent the graph of y equals g of x is g of x equals 1 over x minus 1 plus 1. This is the hyperbola 1 over x that has been translated to the right by one unit and vertically upward by one unit. Now the composition g of f of x is found by replacing the x here with f of x. So that equals 1 over f of x minus 1 plus 1. But f of x is equal to x squared. So g of f of x is equal to 1 over x squared minus 1 plus 1. Now we have a difference of two squares here, which can be factorized. So g of f of x is equal to 1 over x minus 1 in brackets times x plus 1 in brackets plus 1, where x cannot equal negative 1 or 1, or else we'll have a division by 0 here. Now the graph of y equals g of f of x is even, since 1 over x squared minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 1 over negative x in brackets squared minus 1 plus 1. And vertical asymptotes exist at x equals plus or minus 1. Now when x equals 0, y equals 0, so the graph will pass through the origin. And when x equals plus or minus infinity, y will tend to 1, so we'll have a horizontal asymptote at y equals 1. Therefore the answer is option B.